Good morning viewers and welcome to this morning's video. I am in Melbourne and I have this Polaroid 600 SE camera with a 127mm f4.7 lens and with that I'm going to be shooting a pack of Fuji FP100C pack film. Um, it is expired by a couple of years but I have shot expired FP100C before and I haven't noticed too much in the way of needing to adjust the uh, exposure to compensate for the expired film so I'm just going to shoot it at box speed for all of this. It's just coming past sunrise so um, there is a bit of light out but just in case I need to drop my shutter speeds I've brought a tripod along but for the most part I'm just going to try and shoot all of this handheld uh, so let's go and jump straight into it. So I don't know if you can see that, but on the uh, pack film has development time guides. So it's between about 15, 20 degrees Celsius out here at the moment. So it'll take two to three minutes for the shot to develop. Uh, so whilst I'm waiting for this to go, I'm just gonna walk around and take some more photos. Um, all right, you can save these Negs, um, but I'm not going to because I don't really have anywhere to put it on me whilst I'm out in the field. One thing I have been worried about in the past with your yeah, pack film, uh, not the the not the Fuji Instax stuff, like Polaroid pack film, um, Fuji FP100, so FP films the Fuji FP films is uh, I've been concerned that the actual picture is going to remain wet for quite a while and there's nowhere to really safely store it but what I've kind of found is it dries pretty quickly uh, even when it's quite cold so I'm just going to keep them in cold clip as you see here I right, pressed it down pretty hard. Bring it up. It has stuck a little bit. No, it hasn't. I'll just mute that. Um, yeah, it's all good. Where did I step through here? This will need to be probably tripod shot. Wait till these two cars clear out. Oh, it's 
place looks cool. But yeah, if someone just walked through there, it'll take me a while to get set up, so. No one else is coming along, so this has just been an abstract shot. Someone in there. <laughs> awesome. Get past. Okay. Looking for an ice cream shop that's sort of like a wedge cone kind of thing. And my mate James, or Kinematics as you may know, uh, took this like, crazy Dutch angle shot that makes it look like a robot jumping out of the water. That's what I see in it at least. Maybe through, I'll shoot through this structure with someone walking through. So to figure out how far I need to get back. Looks to be quite far. Just a little. Okay. Alright, that is the end of the video. Shot number 10 done. Uh, I'm not sure if you'd see the number 10 there but steady there we go shot number 10 done uh thank you for watching smash like smash subscribe and i will see you on the next one okay.